And then the last guy where we also disagreed on. So we have the whole list we've agreed on besides one player. That's Chris Middleton. I don't have Chris Middleton as my last wild card player. I have your guy, Ben Simmons. I think Ben Simmons is an all-star. I feel like it's hard to not give it to him when they're number one in the East. You can't give Philly one player in the all-star game when you're giving Boston two, when you're giving Milwaukee two. Like, these are two teams that are worse than them. It's hard for me to just be like, you know what? Ben Simmons is not an all-star when, you know, he's one of the best young players in the league. He just dropped 40-plus points the other night. I think he's a really good player. Now, does he put up the stats for it? No, but there's a lot of what Ben Simmons does doesn't show up on the stat sheet. One of the best defenders in the league, you know, high IQ player, one of the best playmakers in the league. I just feel like you got to give it to Ben Simmons. I'm a Ben Simmons known, you know, whatever, hate, not a hater, but you know, I'm, I'm definitely hard on him, but I think you got to give it to Ben. I, what do you think about Ben Simmons right there? Do you have him as your snub or do you have somebody else? I don't have him as my snub, but I'm not going to argue with you putting him there. You know, like I've mentioned it before that I really like him. It's just for some reason this year, he hasn't really put up the stats people expected. He just, but like you said, all of his stuff that he does really well, it doesn't show up on the box score. And that's a little bit unfair to him, but I, I don't know. I just think Levine's scoring and I don't know. I like Middleton. I just, I like the guys I put and he's not even my snub. 